After getting this list together, I'm feeling pretty good about Nike sneakers this year. I think we've not only got some really good options, but also some innovations as well. Today, I'm going over the top 10 best Nike sneakers for 2023. And coming in at number 10 is the Nike Air Max Flyknit Racer. This sneaker is pretty much exactly what it says in the name. It's a mashup of two different Nike models, the Air Max Preday and the Nike Flyknit Racer. Nike Flyknit Racer from 2012 is an absolute classic to me. I loved that sneaker when it dropped. I just could not stop wearing it. So I was pretty interested to find out what this sneaker was all about when it dropped late last year. Overall, I think this is a really solid pair of shoes, but there are a few things to keep in mind if you are considering this sneaker. The first thing that kind of surprised me about this pair of sneakers is that they run a little bit big, but at the same time, they're also a little bit narrow. So I'd actually recommend going a half size down. However, if you do have wider feet because this sneaker is a little bit more on the narrow side, potentially just stick with your true size. The price tag is also a little bit steep, coming in at $160. So I definitely recommend trying to find these on sale, which shouldn't be too hard hard to do even right now. Currently, they are $120 on Nike's website. They are surprisingly comfortable, and that is the main step up from the regular Flyknit Racer. This new midsole that they've added to the sneaker definitely makes it more comfortable. All in all, a solid pair of sneakers for 2023 and a great buy if you're looking for a new daily sneaker that's super comfortable and, in my opinion, looks really good on foot. Coming in at number nine is the Nike Pegasus 39. This is an easy recommendation because this sneaker ticks so many boxes. It's literally one of the most comfortable sneakers that you can buy. It's pretty affordable, retailing at only $120, and oftentimes you can actually find it on sale. There's a ton of variety when it comes to this sneaker, all of the colorways, and even a different, wider version. So it makes it a great sneaker for pretty much anyone. It's a perfectly well-rounded pair of sneakers, whether you're just wearing it casually on a day-to-day -day basis, or whether you're actually going to wear it to the gym. Overall, I can't recommend this sneaker enough. Definitely one of the best Nike sneakers for 2023. Coming in at number eight is the Nike Zoom Femero 5. This pair has one of those origin stories that we hear more and more frequently when it comes to sneakers nowadays. These were originally a running shoe from 2010 and more recently have been brought back by Nike to fulfill the dad shoe trend or the retro running shoe trend, which is still incredibly popular. You could say that this sneaker is Nike's response to the incredible success that New Balance has had with retro running shoes. And from what it looks like, this model is going to have a pretty big year here in 2023. There's a lot of really solid colorways in the pipeline from Nike, and I'm sure they're going to start doing a lot more collaborations this year as well. This sneaker is insanely comfortable as you'd expect and can easily take you through a full day of walking around, standing around. It just keeps you cozy throughout. I think for a retro running sneaker, these look really good. A lot of complex paneling and design details. Coming in at number seven on the list is the classic, the Nike Air Max One. Now I will start by saying that this sneaker is not just on the list because it's a classic Nike model. I put it on this list because here in 2023, it's a great time to pick up a pair of Air Max Ones. Last year, Nike dropped some of the best colorways and color collaborations of the Air Max One. And this year, it seems like they're going to continue that. I mean, on Air Max Day, we're supposed to be getting the return of the Air Max One Big Bubble. And that, I think, will be very interesting. There's so many different variations and options when it comes to the Air Max One. You can get one that looks like an OG colorway, or you can get one that's almost completely different with a collaboration. Whichever way you go with the Air Max One, it's a solid option. There's something for everyone. Coming in at number six is the Nike Sakai Vapor Waffle. Listen, I can't make a top 10 best Nike sneakers list without the Sakai Vapor Waffle on it. This is truly one of my favorite sneakers from Nike. Now I know based on the design, it's not going to be for everyone. It's also only available on the aftermarket, which makes it slightly less accessible and a lot less affordable. But it is such a good pair of shoes. I will say that another option, which is equally as good as the Vapor Waffle, is the Nike Sakai LD Waffle. I'll we'll kind of slide that pair of sneakers in to make this kind of like a dual six spot. And I think with these two options, there's a lot of different colorways. There's a lot of different varying price tags. So it should make it a lot more accessible if you're looking at either one of these pairs of shoes. The Kai Vapor Waffle is literally one of the most comfortable sneakers I've ever put on my feet. I think for the past few years, we've kind of been at the peak of collaborations. There's so many different options, but Sakai and Nike really did something unique with the Vapor Waffle. And I think still to this day, this sneaker really stands out. Both of these are solid options for here in 2023. And coming in at number five on the list is the Nike Jumbo Blazer. This one's another classic, but with a little bit of a twist. I think this one's a great example of how to freshen up a classic sneaker in the right way. It really doesn't stray too far away from the original blazer. Just obviously get its main feature, the jumbo Nike swoosh. There's also some extra uncut leather panels and jagged stitching and a bunch of different lines, but overall it keeps the same DNA as the blazer, just makes it a little bit more 2023. Now, if the enlarged Nike swoosh isn't for you, I still recommend the regular Nike blazer. It is a solid pair of sneakers. The jumbo blazer comes in both a high top version and the low top. In my opinion, it is one of the best 
best sneakers that you can pick up for under $100. Personally, the lows are my favorite, at least aesthetically, but both versions are great, and either one of these is a fantastic option to go for here in 2023. Coming in at number four is another classic, the Nike Air Force One. Now again, very similar situation here to the Air Max One. The Air Force didn't just make it to this list because of its status of being like the most popular sneaker ever, but because it had such a great year in 2022, and it's looking like it's gonna shape out to be the same thing for 2023. There's some really great collaborations that are going to be dropping on the Air Force One. I mean, if you wanna get something really wild, next month they're gonna be doing the Tiffany Air Force One. Obviously, what I'm trying to say here is there's a bunch of variety. There's a bunch of different options, whether you're going for a super hyped up collaboration or whether you're just going for the $100 basic standard Air Force One. It's literally something for everyone, but I think this year in particular is a great time to pick yourself up a pair of Air Force Ones. Definitely one of the best Nikes for here in 2023. Now, before we jump into the top three, let me hit you guys with some honorable mentions. Starting off with the Nike Terminator Low. Now, this one currently you can't get your hands on. Right now, Nike's in the early stages of really trying to revitalize their Terminator line. But the Terminator Low is only going to be dropping later on in 2023. And from what we can tell from leaks and rumors, some of the colorways are looking pretty solid. Another honorable mention would be the ACG Mountain Fly. And there's a couple different versions of this, a low cut and I guess you could say a high cut version, particularly I'm talking about the regular original one. Now this sneaker was designed for trail running, but honestly, it feels incredibly comfortable. You could wear this thing anywhere. Last honorable mention is the Drake Hot Step Air Terra Nocta. I know this sneaker gets a bad rap, but it's a really solid pair of shoes. All right, now with the honorable mentions out the way, let's get into my top three. And taking the third spot is the Nike Invincible Run 3. This sneaker was very close to being like my favorite shoe of 2023. I mean, it's definitely the most comfortable sneaker I've ever tried. It's really the peak of Nike innovation when it comes to cushioning technology. As a full length Zoom X midsole, which Nike usually adds to their most high end performance running sneakers. And it feels absolutely insane when you're walking around in it. Honestly, if you haven't tried Zoom X before, it's almost like a whole new experience. I also think that they did a good job improving it from the previous versions, the one and the two. The main drawback of this pair of sneakers is its price point coming in at a pretty hefty $180. Honestly, even at full retail price, I don't think you'll regret picking a pair of these things up if you value comfort in your sneakers. Coming in at number two is the Nike Dunk Low. Man, the Dunk is just a sneaker that will not die. Nike Dunk just hit the sneaker game like a wave and it has been here to stay ever since. I will say though that here in 2023, it's probably the best time ever to pick up a pair of Dunks. Nike has been absolutely pumping out pairs. It's almost like it's the only sneaker they make. So it's easier now than it's ever been to pick up a pair of Nike Dunks in whatever colorway or version you want. Not only do we have plenty of new colorways in the pipeline, but Nike's also restocking some of those older colorways that were reselling for a huge amount. But whatever colorway or option or version you want to go for, there's literally something for everyone. And I think it's a great time to grab a pair of Dunks here in 2023. And the number one is the Nike Tom Sachs General Purpose Shoe. Yeah, I didn't think I'd be saying that either. This is a sneaker I didn't initially jump on. In fact, I waited a long time from when it originally releases to actually pick up a pair. It was incredibly hyped when it first got announced and obviously the first few drops just completely flew off shelves. But obviously as time has gone on and I've picked myself up a couple different colorways, yeah, I, I, I do think that this is a very solid sneaker. Now it may not be my favorite looking pair of shoes, but that's literally what this sneaker is made for, to be boring. It's created and positioned as an anti-hype sneaker. And honestly, I think it's refreshing that the designer created this pair of sneakers to be available and accessible to everyone. They retail at just $100 and were made to be beaten down and worn for a lifetime. It's well made, it's comfortable, it just ticks all of the boxes. In my opinion, the best colorways are in the pipeline. Let me know your guys' thoughts on today's list and hey, maybe you're not about Nikes and you're more into New Balance. Well, that top 10 is just over there.